What a pleasant surprise. Welcome to your guardian chef, your angel in the kitchen. Today we are making rice eggplant timbal, a risotto lined with grilled eggplants cooked in a mold. Turn it upside down, fill the hole with more sauce and serve. When you cut a slice, you will find a gooey melted mozzarella that stretches all the way to your plate. These are the ingredients you need and the quantities are in the description below. Stir fry the onion with oil at medium heat in a large saucepan. The onion should not burn. Once the onion becomes translucent, add the rice and increase to medium heat. The rice has to be toasted to seal the grains. Deglaze with the white wine. Add a cup of tomato sauce, some stock and stir. If you prefer a white timbal, you can skip the tomato sauce. Proceed to cook the rice like a risotto. The rice should be continually stirred and stock added regularly, one or two ladles at a time. Cook for about 15 minutes. For this recipe, you need risotto rice. Carnarori is the best, second best, arborio. Do not use basmati rice as the grains remain separate and the mold will not keep its shape. Although the consistency of the rice should be compact and not mushy, sushi rice is also unsuitable. Remove from the heat, add the pecorino or parmesan cheese and let it cool down to room temperature. Once it's cold, mix in the eggs. Clean the eggplants, peel the skin, and cut them lengthwise in long slices. Grill the eggplant in a hot iron pan. Season them with salt and let them cool down. Oil a bunt pan with a hole in the center. Line the grilled eggplant slices around the edge of the pan radially from the center to the external side. You can also line it with prosciutto for a non-vegetarian version. Spread the rice on the side of the pan over the eggplant lining, making space to put in the fillings and leave some rice aside to cover the top. Now we place the filling inside. I'm adding cubes of mozzarella and some bolognese sauce I made earlier for this video above. You can also add pre-cooked sausages cut into chunks or fried meatballs. If you want a vegetarian version, only add the mozzarella and some tomato sauce. Cover the top with the remaining rice. Bake in a hot oven at 390 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 200 Celsius, for 40 minutes or until the top of the timbal is nicely browned. Make sure the rice has cooked enough to maintain its shape once turned. If you touch the top, it will be hard and nicely crunchy. Cut the remaining grilled eggplants into bite-sized pieces and add them to the remaining tomato sauce. Once the timbal is cooked, wait 10 minutes before turning the entire dish over onto the serving plate. Fill in the center with the remaining tomato and eggplant sauce and decorate with some basil leaves. When you bring it to the table and cut the first slice, the filling will come out as a nice surprise. It's practical for dinner parties as you can prepare the rice and the filling the day before and compose and bake the timbal just before your party. You can also make this recipe using pasta instead of rice. Baked pasta analetti. For more recipes with eggplants, check the playlist above. And don't forget to subscribe. I will make it to use up my leftover risotto. Why not?